Morning everybody. Morning. Today we're on a day trip towards Bradford Avon. We don't know yet whether we're going to go through the lock as yeah. the weather looks pretty cloudy outside. Yeah. It could be a wet day, it could be a dry day. But anyway, guess what we've got? Cake! Yeah, we've Yay! got... <laughs> Everything's better with cake. So as Tom said, it's um, yeah, the weather's a bit up and down today. We're not quite sure what it's going to do. It's sort of very grey, lots of big grey dark clouds, and also some patches of blue sky. So the forecast is meant to be sunshine and showers. So hopefully we'll be able to have a nice little trip out today. Um, we're heading down towards Bradford and Avon, and fingers crossed, we might be able to get through the um, the lock. And then who knows, perhaps you might be able to get uh, as far as perhaps one of the aqueducts as well. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, so far, so good. The weather seems to be holding up really, really well. Um, it's a little bit busy this morning. Um, quite a few boats going past. Haven't seen a lot of um, higher boats yet, but I'm pretty sure that once we get towards Bradford Neighbour, there will probably be lots and lots of them around. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if we end up sharing the lock with uh, a higher boat as well. Oh my goodness. Don't know what's happened to this boat here. So we're not too far away now from uh, Bradford Navon. Um, it's been quite a while since we've been down this way and it's actually quite busy as you can see. Um, yeah, it's lovely to see all the boats stay here, all moored up. And of course we're going to head then, hopefully, down towards the, uh, the lock. Fingers crossed we'll get through it okay. And it won't be too busy either. Very narrow here. You struggle to get a wide beam through here. And this is Bradford Avon. Just about to come to the lock. Okay, so you can see it's uh, very, very busy around here. Lots of higher boats as well. Um, lovely little shop here where you can get some ice cream, some little snacks, coffees, teas, that type of thing, and yeah, nice cakes. Um, we've been there quite a few times in the past, and I'm pretty sure when things start to reopen up again properly, I'm pretty sure we'll be going back there again to get another uh, another ice cream or something nice for the boys. Um, they also sometimes sell canalware there as well. Uh, we've actually bought a pot from there with the roses on and painted roses and I use that for my cutlery so it's well worth going into that little shop okay there you can see the Barbara 
McClellan, I think that's how they say it. It's the, um, a hire boat that uh, takes people out on day trips. It's actually a day trip boat. Um, quite a nice, nice little trip to do, to go up and down the canal for a little bit. And you can just see the, uh, the lock there ahead, nice and quiet. So hopefully we should be able to just head straight towards that and go in. If you can see there, um, just on the other side of the lock where there's a bridge with traffic going over, um, not so long ago, actually a couple of weeks ago, there was a car that actually went into the bridge. So lots of the bridge actually crumbled and fell into the lock. So we had to close the lock for a little while and um, clear it all out. Very, very busy bridge that one. Um, yeah, lots of people and lots of cars. And it's a nightmare for crossing over the road. If you want to cross over the road, the other side of the uh, the lock, there are some nice pubs, which you'll see as we go through. So I'm just filling up the lock with water at the moment. As you can see, there was a slight accident the other day on this bridge. A car this, or tractor or something decided to go through the edge of the bridge. The lock is nearly ready. There you go. So you can see now there's the um the bridge going over the lock and you can see exactly where the car went into the side of it in fact they'll be uh, repairing that soon okay so you may remember i said there was a, um, a few really nice pubs around here um just going past a few, if you look carefully, you can see there's a boat there. You can actually sit on the side of that boat and have your meal whilst at the pub. It's really nice in there too. I've been there quite a few times. It's really, really pretty around here. Lots of nice pubs. Those get lots of nice ice cream as well. And for those ladies, there's a lovely, lovely little shop. Um, just ahead there and it's called by the way and they have lots of really nice things like cards gifts lots of pretty scarves <laughs> which i have bought quite a few of in the past um yeah lots of really nice things in there so it's called by the way really nice little shop there so we've just done the lock now we're heading this way Avoncliff. Oh no, it's just starting to rain. I've got my coat on. Julie and the boys are inside. I'm going to find somewhere to moor, hopefully. Seems a bit odd. There's a boat that looks like it's across water in front. I don't know what that's all about, but I think I'll, go, I'll find out in a minute. And the cake of the day is do, 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 drum roll do, 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 lemon cake yay, yay. So it's quite nice to be back out again, going for a walk. Um, it's been quite a while since we've been here. But anyway, we're going to enjoy it. I'm going to head towards the, uh, the yeah. aqueduct, Avoncliff aqueduct, have a look. And then hopefully, I've got two excited little boys here that want to have some ice cream as well. Lovely and quiet. Apart from the odd train passing through. No boats, it's just really, really quiet.
quite early actually. Here's the boat, it's the trip boat, it's the um, Kennet and Avon Canal Trust trip boat, the Barbara McClellan, which I showed you earlier on, and it's crossing the aqueduct. Perfect! And I'm so glad the rain stopped as well, it makes all the difference. Nine no, pounds for free ice cream. Wow, that was. Nice ice cream, though, Tom. Yeah, oh yeah. Got one strawberry, one chocolate, and one salted caramel. All by Marshfield Farm, which is not very far away. I got my dip. Not very far away. I got my dip. In Bath, very very nice ice cream. I strongly recommend it. Actually, a bit expensive though, but it's really really nice ice cream. Okay, so Tom's just turned the boat around and uh, we're just crossing back over the, uh, the aqueduct at Avon Cliff and we're going to be heading back towards Bradford and Avon, head towards the lock, go through the lock and then hopefully stop for a barbecue and then it'll be onwards back to the marina. So we're now coming back into Bradford Haven. Soon we're having to, gonna have to do the lock, which is it's always a very busy lock. So that will be fun seeing how many boats are around.
you've enjoyed your little trip with us today towards Bradford Navon and Avoncliff. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you've liked our videos. Hope to see you soon. Bye. Bye.